<laughs> All right, first outfit for the leather leggings. I'm doing this acidy green sweater from Zara. Um, I just think it's really fun. And once again, I like things that distract from the actual leather leggings, um, where they're not exactly the focal point. Even though these are a little bit more subtle, I just think it's kind of a fun pop. Um, I always like putting something on that's a little longer, because I just think people's butts look, people's butts look weird in leather leggings. So anyways, I'm doing this sweater, and then I will show you I'm doing these bad boys. I think a combat boot is just always really cool. These ones are from Zara, and I absolutely love the heavy chain. I just think it's very, very cool. t-shirt from Zara and then I put these on with it. Um, they're really cool. They are treasure and bond. These were from last year's anniversary, anniversary sale. Um, and I love the, it's not showing up quite as bold here, but, um, these grommets are just, I don't wear a lot of jewelry. So I think anytime you can sneak in a little metal, it's kind of cool. Um, so yeah, I'm going to style the tennis shoes with this leather legging and this would just be like a cute, like you're sort of trying. Like if I'm going to the grocery store or something, I look like I try just to, like a touch more than someone in a tracksuit, which is my goal. I want to look just like 5% better than your average mom. So I think this kind of at least gives the impression that you care just like a little bit. I care a little bit. Leather butt, and then I did these. 
They are leather, um, they are, scratch that. It's been a long day. They're um, leopard ankle booties. Um, I think leopard is so fun in a shoe. And the great thing about this is, I mean, these are actual heels, but you could do a leopard flat or anything like that and it would work and be just kind of, it's your, it's your little punchy piece because this is kind of just, you know, whatever. But anyways, this could be dress up or dress down, I guess, depending on your heel length. And once again, as a mom, I mean, I would wear these shoes out. I don't know that I would wear them like trucking my kids around, but every once in a while I have a reason to dress up. Welcome to my basement where we did the how to style. I hope you guys liked it. Um, I thought it was fun and I wanted to do something that, I know it's not edgy, I didn't do any crazy looks. Um, it's just it's just me being a mom, trying to show you guys how to style things so that it's maybe just like a little bit edgy without being like, holy crap, what's that mom wearing? Who does she think she is? She's not Kim Kardashian. So anyways, if you guys like it, give us a thumbs up. I plan on doing a lot more of these if you like them. Um, I'm gonna try to do a couple more with the anniversary sale pieces that I got, especially the ones that maybe stumped me a little bit and I was like, ah, how do I wear this? And I played around in my closet and kind of figured it out. So, um, I am, this is what I'm wearing right now um, in the basement. Um, I did it in the basement because it's like 95 today. So, coolest room in the house is the basement. It's also the only room in our house that doesn't have um, like Legos on the floor. So, anyways, um, we'll see you guys in the next one. But if you like it, give us a thumbs up, um, and I'll just keep doing more of these. And then hopefully we can inspire some moms to try to like I want to dress a little outside of my comfort zone, but I'm not gonna be wearing a crop shirt. Um, so, anyways, if you like this, give us a thumbs up, and we will do more of these. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Thank you.